The Adventures of Luna and the Magic Forest Once upon a time in a small town in America, there was a little girl named Luna. She was seven years old with bright blue eyes and curly brown hair. Luna was known for her curious nature and love for adventures. One sunny afternoon, while playing in her backyard, Luna noticed a shimmering light near the old oak tree. As she approached, the light grew brighter, and suddenly, with a gentle whirl, Luna found herself in a magical forest. This was no ordinary forest. The trees were candy-colored. The flowers sang in sweet melodies, and friendly animals roamed freely. Luna was amazed. She had read about magical places in her storybooks, but she never imagined she would be in one. As Luna wandered through the forest, she met a talking rabbit named Mr. Hops. Mr. Hops wore a little red vest and had the most charming smile. Welcome to the magic forest, Luna, he said. I am the guardian of this land. Our world is in trouble and we need your help. Luna was surprised. Me, huh? But how can I help? Mr. Hops explained that the heart of the forest, a magical gem that kept the forest alive, had been stolen by a mischievous pixie. Without it, the forest would slowly lose its magic. Determined to help, Luna and Mr. Hops embarked on an adventure to find the heart of the forest. They crossed rivers where fish glittered like diamonds, climbed mountains with candy cane peaks, and explored valleys where the grass was as soft as cotton. Along the way, they met various magical creatures, a bear who loved to cook, a group of dancing squirrels, and a wise old owl who gave them clues about the pixie's whereabouts. Finally, they reached a dark cave where the pixie lived. The pixie, seeing Luna and Mr. Hops, realized the importance of the heart of the forest and felt sorry for her actions. She returned the gem and apologized. With the heart of the forest restored, the magic land bloomed once again. The trees swayed with joy, the flowers sang louder, and the animals danced in celebration. Luna felt a warm glow in her heart, knowing she had helped save this magical world. As the sun began to set, Mr. Hops escorted Luna back to the oak tree. You will always be a hero in the magic forest, he said. Luna returned to her backyard just as dinner was being called. She looked back at the old oak tree, smiling, knowing that a part of her would always belong to the magic forest. From that day on, Luna carried the magic with her. She shared her story with friends and family, reminding them that even in our world, a little bit of kindness and bravery can make a big difference. And so... Luna's adventure in the magic forest became a treasured tale, passed down through generations, inspiring children to believe in magic, wonder, and the power of a courageous heart.